For President Obama, his visit to Kenya is a trip of first. The first time an American president has ever come here, but his first trip as president. This is, of course, his ancestral homeland. It is where his father is buried. It's where his 93-year-old step-grandmother still lives. So there is an emotional resonance here, and it's been highly anticipated. His entire family considered a royal family here in Kenya. And you can see how the preparations have been underway. A half million dollar beautification project that they call Obamacare, where they've been painting and sprucing up and cleaning up, particularly the roadway leading from the airport uh, to where the conferences will be. But there's also serious business going on here. And the first part of it is about economic development. And you can see, if you look behind me at the cityscape of Nairobi, there are so many cranes there all across the sky. And that is really about why the president is coming here. Uh, this is a country that has shown a lot of economic development. They, for example, are leaders in cell phone technology, uh, but they're bringing together hundreds of entrepreneurs for a summit that he will co-host. But also, they'll be talking about counterterrorism. El Shabaab remains a threat in this region, and he's traveling with 20 members of Congress who are particularly interested in that, and also in human rights. A lot of concerns about the human rights practices both here and in Ethiopia, where he goes next and we're listening for what he has to say about LGBT rights in particular because the last time he was on the African continent and made comments about it there was a lot of blowback and so we'll be listening not just for what he says but how he says it and how publicly but the first big public event he has here and the Kenyans have been waiting six years since he was elected president for it actually happens on Saturday. Hey NBC News fans, thanks for checking out our YouTube channel. Subscribe by clicking on that button down here and then click on any of the videos over here to watch the latest interviews, show highlights, and digital exclusives. Thanks for watching.